Ah! Is the play coin? How's it going, everyone? Welcome back to Flames Plays and Dare Checking Out Goodbye Gordon. Now, I've said this before, and I'll say it again Half Life is one of my favorite game series of all time. And while it hasn't been really scary, aside from maybe Raven Home or anything like that, I love the idea of a Half Life horror game. So I want to check this out. This is available over on Itch.io, and I'll have a link in the description down below if you want to check it out yourself. It is free. Ah, hello, Gordon. Another day, another do dollar, am I right? Now, now Gordon, we'd better, better, better get a move on. Dr. Breen doesn't sound too good. Also, the tram car hasn't opened yet. So this has actually been recreated from the original uh, gold source files in Unity. And, you know, it looks... This this opening area looks pretty accurate. I, uh, I don't see any issues so far. Maybe our footsteps are a little loud, I will say. Oh, Barney's dead, and we haven't even started yet. The Residence Cascade hasn't begun. Oh, God. Did you say play coins? Security. Oh. Oh, my God. They included the sound of the flashlight turning on. I love it. So, zero to six play coins collected. What ah! is the play coin? For God's sake. Oh, my God. Fuck. I'm just going to flat out say that. Jesus Christ, that got me good. What do we got here? Uh oh. I hear footsteps. Oh, I'm stuck. I'm stuck in a computer. I've. Oh my god. I've been playing this for a total of four seconds, and I'm already stuck in a computer. I don't like you. No, please don't walk closer to me. I'm going to saunter. Oh, oh my god. I got free somehow. Jesus. Oh, that is very ominous. Oh, okay. So he follows me. Goody. That's all I'm going to say is goody. Can I open doors? No, I can't open doors. Will destroy you. Okay. I would prefer it if he did not destroy me. If at all possible. My, my oh, whoa! Boy, nope. Jeez. Oh my god. Okay, I actually am liking this a lot. Very slender-esque, but it's actually getting me pretty good. I will say. I got, I got half of them so far. Ah! ah, didn't give me that time. Because you spawned too soon, I think. That was, uh, the first one caught me good. I was not expecting that. I kind of just expected to be, like, patrolling. Because generally with these kinds of games, I try not to read too much into them. I don't watch videos about it. I don't, uh-oh. Uh-oh. That's a dead end. That's a dead end. Huh? Ha ha! I juked him out. Oh, you got nothing. You got nothing. Oh, he's actually Hello, going. Gordon. Nope. Is he going faster? Oh, this is a dead end too. All right. The jukes. Later. My I get. Could... Uh oh. I don't want your power to grow. Oh, did he? He despawned. Are there? Are there like areas where they'll spawn at, and that's where they chase you around, and then once you leave that area, they they despawn and show up in a different area? If so, that's an interesting way to handle um, like your AIs and not patrolling constantly. That's nothing there. Authorized personnel only? I think I'm authorized. I'm Gordon freaking Freeman. Doctor Hoover is after you. You must run immediately. Okay, when you're making that- Oh, there's the HEV suits, or where they should be at least. Rap. I think he's walking faster. Uh-oh. Oh, that's a dead end. Oh my god, how did I get away? I remember. No, you don't. You're a robot. You don't remember anything. You've been programmed to remember. Oh, I got stuck. No, oh, no, no, don't kill. No kill. Everyone's be cool. Everyone be cool. We don't need to kill here. I remember. No, I don't like how he's moving faster. That is actually the most terrifying part of this whole thing. Oh crap, this is a dead end. All right, ah, circle hello, around. Gordon. Nope. Nope, nope, no hellos. I don't want hellos. I want to leave this area and go back to MIT. I don't ah, like how hello, fast Gordon. he's moving. Oh, this is a dead end. Okay, but I can scootaloo past him. No big deal. Everything is A-OK. -okay. Oh! Me, your friend, Dr. Kuma. 
Dr. Coomer? I don't remember that being a name, but okay. Ah, hello, Gordon. Oh no, don't tell me. Don't tell me this is gonna be a dead end. <gasps> Last play coin. I got it. You beat the video game. Yay? I guess. Okay, well, what happens if he gets you? I gotta replay this now. I really wanna see what happens if he gets you. I l All right, so I'll get my reviews now. Uh, I actually like this a lot. Ah, just Gordon. from the start. Another day, another do do dollar, am I right? Just from the start, it's now, very Gordon, uh, be be messed up. You know on, there's on. something wrong with it. You cannot trick someone by changing the menu screen to match the original Half-Life and then say, yeah, this is uh, this is Half-Life. And sell it to a bad hard drive. But the jump scare got me really good. The entire area is very well done. It's it's not the original Half-Life 1 underscore uh, 1 that the actual level is, but it's got enough changes to it that I feel it's different enough. Alright, so we're going to grab the first coin. And we're going to let him get me. He spawns in here, it sounded like. So, like, there's these vents. I wonder if this, that, I can do anything. Is this the original Half-Life map? There's some, there's definitely some changes to it. But I, I really want to see what happens if he catches me. We'll grab some of these coins. Dr. Coomer will destroy you. There you go. Right. So let's grab, let's just grab a third point. Why not? You know, just do it. And then we'll let him get us. Ah, hello, Gordon. Goodbye, Gordon. <laughs> Alright, I'm glad I went back he for the was death. My best friend, but he owed me seven dollars. <laughs> he was my best friend, but he owed me seven dollars. Alright, I'm glad I went back to get that death because the punch was awesome. Um, yeah, I really can't say anything negative about it. It's a very simple game. It's it's a Slenderman clone, but made within the Half-Life style, which I like a lot. But let me know what you guys all think in the comments down below. Give me a thumbs up. I really do appreciate that. And also make sure you're subscribed to get updates for at least new content or go live while live streaming. And as always, have a great day. Remember to burn bright. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye. Thank you so much for watching the video. I just want to give a quick shout out to my Patreon supporters listed down below. Philip A. Chapman, Megaco, and Monica Bean. Thank you for the ongoing support. And if you want to see your name down here, be sure to check the links in the description below to my Patreon, as well as my Twitter and Discord. Have a great day. Remember to burn bright.